in our last session we have seen that what is angular js so in this session we will see and the examples of angular js so friends now we are on desktop so first i will open notepad plus plus here it is notepad plus plus in my desktop it's a shortcut uh, let's open it so here you can see a blank document here i will write my angular js program so let's start it as i had said you that uh, angular js program is written inside an html so let's write an html program and use our angular js so first we need to download angular js framework for our angular js program so for that you have to go to google chrome or any of your browser simply open it and write download angular js framework cdn so here you can see there are so many websites which provide you angular js cdn so let's go with this one so here google provides an angular js cdn that is an online link to angular js framework so we need to copy this link and include it in your notepad plus plus so you have to include that uh, and cdn link within this script tag here i will paste that link let's write type sql2 now starting our body tag let's say in a script tag i'm going to write this is my first angular program let insert and div as i told you that uh, our angular js program starts from ng app so you have to write ng app within any of the element of html it could be within div it could be within body tag or within your html so i'm going to write it inside the div so it will be like ng app is equal to initially i'm going to write it blank because uh, it's a basic example so you do not need to write any name here basically we provide the name our application name the module name inside this ng app so right now for an example purpose i'm leaving this blank and uh, just writing something welcome mr miss xyz now save it angular js examples file one and let's make the extension as html then save it now you can run your angular js program from notepad plus plus itself and from google chrome the browsers so let's run it from here launch in chrome so this is my first angular program welcome mr and miss xyz so now let's include another directive of angular js that is ng init is equal to say a variable name like uh, guest user is equal to learn one so now i will use this guest user in place of xyz and i can do it using curly braces so inside the curly braces i will write that variable name guest user so what it will do it will simply take the value of guest user that is learn one while initializing this app okay so let's run it let's save it go to run launch in chrome so here you can see that it came welcome mr or miss learn one or we can provide many styles let's make it bold 
see so this part is coming from ng in it which is the responsibility of angular js to tackle with these variable so we can also print this value the guest user within a by using ng bind okay so how we'll do that simply write a span tag and let's put ng bind is equal to your angular variable name guest user now see i have removed the curly braces and i wrote ng bind instead of curly braces so it will have the same impact as the curly braces was giving us let's save it and run it the same effect but by using ng bind so friends you must be wondering then what is the function of ng app if it is doing nothing it's a blank so as i have told you that it's a starting point of the program angular just finds this directive and start the executing of the rest of the program so if you will remove this ng app then what will happen let's see see that variable is not recognized as the browser knows that here no angular js program is going to execute as ng app is missing so whatever if you write uh, within curly braces then also it will not work simply it will display this portion guest user save it and run see but when i include that ng app is equal to blank then it recognizes that yeah it's an angular js program and i have to execute some code so save it and run it and it comes so friends this is the basic example of uh, angular js so here i would like to tell you one another thing that uh, instead of uh, importing the framework by online you can do it offline also for that you need to download your angular.mean.js file in chrome so just go and write download angular js click on this link here you can see download angular js click on this here it comes that branch build cdn you can also download that cdn from here also no so just click on download button it is asking me to keep or discard so allow it to keep just download it open it show in folder you can copy this uh, file and paste it in your folder where are you working on or you could simply give this path as your source src so i'm going to copy it and i will paste it in my folder for convenience so let's copy it and paste it in my folder so now i just need to input this name inside my files so you do not need to write all these things you just write the file name that is angular.mean.js now save it now launch it go see it is working so this is all about the first very first program of angular js hope you understood the basic concept so in the same manner in our following upcoming session we will see lots of program so thanks so friends we have learned that uh, what is angular js how to perform a basic example of angular js in our next session we will see what is scope and data binding and expressions in angular js